Hey guys, Sock here from Sock e Tech, and in today's video, we are going to be talking about the latest update to Bixby. So we do have a bunch of new features. The biggest one is we have a brand new compact design for Bixby dictation. So let's dive in and see what's going on. Now, first and foremost, to get all these updates, there are going to be three separate updates. You want to click the link down below. It's going to drop you to my website. When you go down a little bit, you want to check each one of these links right here. So the first one is the main Bixby link. You want to make sure this is up to date. Tap on update at the bottom here if you see it. And then if you go back over here, uh, you also want to update the Bixby dictation component. You click on this one. You want to make sure it says install at the bottom and it's up to date. If it's supposed to be updated, it's going to have a button, all right? And then finally, number three is the Bixby wake up component of Bixby. You click that link and you want to make sure that is also up to date. There should be a button at the bottom. OK, now once you do that, let's look at all the new features of the brand new Bixby update that was just released. Now, for reference here, I have the old version here and the new version here. So let me show you the biggest change. So normally when you want to use Bixby, uh, you can say hi Bixby or you can uh, press and hold on the button. All right. So if I press and hold on the button, that's the old version. Look at what I get at the bottom. This is the old version of the Bixby interface right here, as you can see. And if I were to ask it a question again, what's the weather like in New York today? Today in New York, New York, it is partly cloudy with a high of 85 degrees and a low of 71 degrees. So that's what I get. I get a full screen view. All right. All right. So with the new Bixby, here's what's new. So press and hold. And look at that. That's the brand new design that we have. It's more compact. OK, with this one, it was a little bit different, as you saw. All right. I didn't understand. So one more thing I'm going to show you guys. And this is the other option. What they do is on the top, it gives you a bunch of recommendations of what it thinks you want to do uh, based on your previous action. So I can create a reminder, open the camera app, take a selfie, take a screenshot. Uh, show pictures I took yesterday. These are just suggestions that populate on the top in this small compact screen. Additionally, when I ask Bixby a question, look at the way it uh, uh, delivers the answer. So what's the weather like in New York today? Today in New York, New York, it is partly cloudy with a high of 85 degrees and a low of 71 degrees. OK, so basically I get this nice compact design that doesn't go full screen. It's just a little card on the screen. And of course, the size of that card is going to be dependent on what you ask Bixby. So, for example, if I ask her something simple, what's two plus two? It's four. OK, so you're going to get a smaller answer card right here. Another example. How many days in a year? A year is usually 365 days long. So the size of that card is going to differ based on what you ask. With this one, what's the weather like in New York today? Today in New York, New York, it is partly cloudy. With a it goes full screen as you just saw. All right. So that's a huge difference. The, the biggest difference that we have. Now, the other thing that we have, which is the final difference, is now we have better Spotify integration. So if I go into Bixby Home, I'm going to show it to you right now. Tap on Home. Now, I don't use Spotify myself. So if you are a Spotify user, let me show you what that is. Tap on Notices. Go to Bixby July Updates. And at the bottom, it says Simplified Spotify Authentication. So connect to Spotify account quickly with the new simplified authentication. All you do is you bring up Bixby and you say play Spotify and it's like that's going to get you started. So let me see what it does. Play Spotify. All right, playing the Spotify playlist, today's top hits. So it looks like I do have Spotify in there. So look at that easy integration. It, it just you just say play Spotify. Boom, it starts to play it. All right. So that's also brand new and the compact design. All right. Any questions, comments or concerns? Drop them down below. Let me know for now, guys. Have a fantastic day, all right? All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video.
And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.